This past spring break, I had the great joy of going to Juarez, Mexico and building houses for those who needed it in conjunction with the Campus Christian Fellowship here at Georgia Tech. And I have to say, it was one of the greatest experiences that I've ever had. But there was something that I noted, something that you can't really demonstrate through just saying, oh, I went on this trip, I went on this. I was reading a book the other day. It was called Leaders Eat Last. So for those who don't know me, I am a huge leadership fan. I love studying it, I love watching leaders act, and I try my best to be a leader. And one of the things in that book they mentioned about leaders was that leaders give time and energy. Not just money, they don't just supervise people, they give their life and blood for a cause. And it was really interesting. I spent the whole spring break not getting a job and getting paid, not doing work, which I really need to catch up on, but acting in service of others. But let me tell you, this is not intended to be a brag. I'm not trying to say, I'm fantastic because I did this. I'm telling you because as a selfish individual, I had so much fun going on this trip, meeting the family, building stuff for them, getting to interact with all the people around me. It was one of the greatest experiences that I've ever had. And yet, when you look at it from the outside, it's a selfless act. It's simply you going, being a good person, going out and enjoying something. But I didn't go on that trip for them. No. I went on that trip selfishly because I enjoy helping others. And so, do, so does everyone else. It's in our biology. There's a reason that we want to be with others, why we're social creatures, and why we always want to earn trust from people because it helps us survive. When other people trust us, we, are, we have a higher chance of surviving. Think about it, back in the day, cavemen. If people didn't bond, we don't have the tools to defend ourselves. So, what does this have to do with the service trip? When you help others, they trust you. When you give time to others, they trust you. When you give your blood, sweat, and tears for others, they trust you. And when they trust you, you enjoy it. I enjoy it. It was a great experience. I was doing a selfless act, but in the end, the reason that motivates us to help others, to gain this trust, is for ourselves. And that's okay. I'm not saying that as a negative thing. In fact, I encourage y'all to indulge in this experience that is helping others because it feels good to you. Indulge in that. Don't just give money. Don't just supervise things. Don't just put it on your resume. Do something else for someone else because it feels good to you. Don't give money, give time. So the next time you're out and about, just think, I want to help that person, not for them, but because it feels good inside. And it's going to benefit not only them, but also yourself.